Hey YouTube, it's Alicia here. Good afternoon and happy Valentine's Day to everybody. Now, I wanted to come and talk about Project Runway. Now, the reason I'm talking about Project Runway is I'm going to start starting today. Start talk when it's now it's getting down time, getting down to the last couple of shows until the um finale i will re be reviewing so this one is live and let tada is this one and this is a one day one night challenge and they couldn't go to sleep and let me just tell you something when i saw who was like in the high and then i saw the two that was in the low i was like i kind of questioned they um i kind of question project runway of keeping somebody that should have been um should have been uh eliminated but i digress two people so we're going to start with um the people who was in the hive you got Nancy, Sergio, and Jeffrey. And Jeff and uh, Jeffrey is the one who won. He had sort of like this army type, like camo like uh, gimmick, but it worked for him with the touches of um uh, orange. I loved it. It was great. Sergio, he had sort of like this. Has he did like a tie dye with all yellow in it. And as y'all know, on any on anybody, it looks good. But on black women, it, it always pop. And he made that dress pop. And Nancy's, it was, I liked it, the pack color pattern. But it's like the headpiece, she just could have just left off or put it on as a shawl or something. But, yeah, Nancy could have did, those was the hop. Now, my like I'm saying, my favorite was Jeffrey, Brittany, and I hope I pronounced this black guy's name right, Marquez. I hope I pronounced that right. Overall, it was great. It was a great show. But let me talk about the bottom two. The bottom two was Devon and Victoria. And I'm going to give my point of view. I felt like Victoria should have been the one that went home. How many times has she been in the bottom? Let's count them. One, two, three, four. I think this is her fourth or fifth time being in the bottom. I get it. She's a good designer. But how can you keep on saving the same person over and over and over and over and you don't give Devon that opportunity and save him over and over. And I want y'all to think of the people that they sent home. Now, let's talk about, um, I, I want to um, also in this one talk about last week's um elimination that Brittany ended up being saved. Now, the one I want to talk about was the tuxedo challenge. And I need to talk about Sergio. And the reason I got to talk about Sergio is how did he not know his outfit? Trying to say, oh, his outfit is not a, a recreation. It's not a recreation. Yes, it was. It was a recreation of. It was a recreation of Celine Dion's 1999's um, suit. And you just you can you can just tell as soon as I saw him start, you know, designing and everything, that suit. I'm doing two reviews in one. But as you saw last week, Brittany was safe. Christian Ciano uses Christian safe. Now I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna uh, talk to y'all about about the show, what I like about it and everything, but I'm overall for the for both shows from last week to this week. I think they both did great, but you gotta admit, um, because they spent a lot from Victoria are they keep and the question of the day with this is because Victoria keeps getting saved over and over and over 
And when she's in the bottom, this is her fifth time being in the bottom. Don't quote me on it. I think it's her fourth or fifth time being in the bottom. Why is the judges keep saving her? That's the question. Why they keep saving her and why they did not give Devon that opportunity. All right, y'all. I'm Alicia. I have you back with my other Project Runway video. I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumbs up this video. Comment below. And subscribe to my channel.